All right. I was tagged by Jeps Outdoor Adventures. He's a young man with a young channel, loves the outdoors, and uh, he tagged me and several others in a video to do to show our cook kit. And uh, I'll do a couple of tags at the end of mine. You, uh, you can do it if you want to. You're under no obligation, of course. But uh, go check his channel out. He's a young guy, young and uh, with a love for the outdoors and bushcraft and survival mindsets and things like that, which is great, you know, for a kid his age. He's uh, not at home playing video games. He'd rather be outdoors, so that's very cool. And go over and give him some support some support and check him out and uh, yeah just give him some support you know give him some inspiration and things like that because uh, these the youth today need it all we can do you know they need all they can get so but uh, go check him out he's got a cool channel he's got some cool stuff on there so but I appreciate the tag too Jip so um, all right he wanted to know my cook set what I use and, I'll, and uh, I have several items and actually, a couple of them are the um, same thing he has. And it's one of the things that a lot of people have. I see a lot of people with these. And I use this. I carry this with me all the time because I just like it that much. But I keep all my stuff in a uh, these little nylon bags. Keep it all together. You get these, like, pack of three of them for, like, five bucks at Walmart. But uh, one of them is this. The Stanley cook set and uh, I love it I love this thing this thing is awesome I've used this more than anything um, it's got a little plastic lid you know uh, pull tab <laughs> so but I need to replace that I'd like to replace that with a with a metal tab and because uh, it's already kind of melted slightly but I just haven't done it yet um, but it, it comes with a, one of these insulated green cups, you know. So, and it comes with two of them. But I only keep one in here because a lot of times what I'll do is there's a lot of room in there. I will stick stuff in there, carry stuff inside this. I, I've got, a lot of times I'll put matches, you know, some bullion cubes and just some, just some things like that. Just stuff in there where it won't take up any more room in my pack or anything like that. And I'll just carry stuff in there. But it's got a cool lid. It's got holes in it to drain, things like that. But it, it's even got a graduated marks where you can tell how much is in there, measuring cup, basically. But Stanley Cook set, and uh, I really like it. This is one of my favorite things that I use, and I also use this. It's just an Ozark Trail Hurricane Cup. And you use this quite a bit, and I just stick this in there to uh, put it in the bag. So it all folds up nice and neat. Let's see here. Also, what I have here too, this is also Ozark Trail from Walmart. I did a video on this a while back, and I actually got this. Comes in a nice, nice little mesh bag. But I actually got this. It was on sale at Walmart. And uh, a lot of times they'll have the outdoor displays and stuff when they're trying to get rid of stuff. This is the last one they had. It was five bucks or five or six bucks or something. I think it's normally like 12 or something like that. Anyway, stainless steel. And see there, I got stuff in here already. So I got, I got some coffee. I got two of these water bags, basically, and uh, it's got two pots. Can't think of how big they are, you know, how much they hold, but they hold quite a bit. And it's all stainless steel, and it's got these rubberized handles, which are pretty much worthless. So I need to peel that off there. I just haven't done it yet either. I just figure I'll just wait until they fall off. But uh, excellent set, excellent set. I haven't really used this a whole lot. I've used it a few times. And I don't carry this with me all the time in my pack because it's a bigger item. But 
you know the lid fits this it's got the little metal top right here it's also got some marks where it fits this as well so but it works really well and that's for bigger items and stuff if i want to cook some things you know like you know bigger items for soup you know things that maybe like me and my wife or kids or something like that go camping i can cook more than just one single meal because this thing right here it's basically just a one single meal but uh so far that's that's very cool in my newest edition that i've gotten which i absolutely love is this pathfinder camp kettle I absolutely love this thing and I did a video on this thing a while back and I've used it several times on and off camera it's awesome it's awesome it's got the uh, screen in there for coffee or you know any type of medicinal things you know uh, plants and things like that teas whatever have you whatever you can come up with this thing works excellent I love it and uh, Jeff also said in his video that he likes that that burnt look on there like that after you clean it and stuff. I actually do too. I like that tarnished kind of burnt patina on there because you know it makes me think of uh, that it's been used of course and uh, makes me think of you know when I did use it and kind of puts a memory in my head you know whether it's just out in the woods over you know for an hour or two or anything like that but Pathfinder Camp Kettle. Awesome. Awesome. I absolutely love it. Recommend it. And one of the things I use too, also, get it out of here, is this e -Tech City. Um, stove top stove camp to, you know a cooker so if I don't want to have a fire anything like that I carry this stuff in my pack at all times so if I don't want to make an actual fire you know wood fire campfire then I will use this and this was not very expensive at all and it works great so but yeah I use that to cook things on some coffee whatever have you because you know me if you've seen my videos i like drinking coffee i like, I like drinking coffee in the woods can't beat it so but yeah that's very cool and it comes in handy also what i carry too in my pack not all the time but a lot of times this right here i actually found this on the middle in the middle of the street and i saw it and i had to turn around and get it because i was like hey you know and this is actually one of those good solid heavy duty grill tops Came out, must have fell out of somebody's vehicle or truck or something like that, but it was laying there and I grabbed it. And I've used it a few times, but it actually, in the back of my pack, there's a sleeve in there behind, right behind me, and I can actually slide that down right in there. And uh, I need to get a, a uh, bag for it so I won't get my pack all dirty with black you know, soot and everything. But I use this, and I'll take it out and I'll use it. And it works very well. So, uh, but one of the things that I do have also, which I didn't bring out with me, is I picked up a cast iron skillet at one of our local resale shops, um, like a Goodwill shop. And it was just, you know, it's just a smaller skillet, medium sized, but it's cast iron. I got to, you know, uh, clean it all up and season it and everything else like that. But that's something that I won't, I won't carry it in my pack necessarily, but I will, uh, take it out in the woods with me if we go car camping and things like that and a good cast iron skill it's awesome so but that's my that's my cook kits one of the things that I do want to get though that I have not gotten yet which are not very expensive you can get them unissued but I do want to get the USGI mess kit it's basically like you know people use it as a frying pan but it's not really a frying pan but um, but people use it as a frying pan so it's a good multi-use item but that's one of, that's what I got this is what I got so that's what I use and uh, so use some of these MRE spoons and things like that you know uh, for silverware and stuff but I'd like to get you know a good you know one of those you know titanium 
fork spoon things together or just some kind of decent you know silverware type stuff so but anyway that's what I got that's what I use and I'm I use this most of all right here these items right here this is my most used item and I take this with me along with me now where I go because I actually really like it and I plan on using that quite a bit but anyway I got some tags here that I'd like you know show uh, show me your cook kits and uh, show Jeff too here's tags you like I said you know under no obligation but if you want to do it do it hand handle prepper I'd like to see what you got I've seen your videos great channel great channel awesome guy fantastic does a lot with his son teaching his son some outdoor items and, and some survival things and and uh, just very good very good channel very awesome channel and uh, waypoint survival I'd like to you know uh, see what he's got he's very cool very cool channel does a lot of outdoor stuff I think he actually might um, teach some uh, bushcraft and survival classes or something like that so I'd like to see what he's got and then my buddy ZZ outdoors I'd like to see what he's got I've seen him I've seen a lot of his stuff over the years and uh, he's got a great channel very cool dude too and uh, just an all-around pleasant channel and a very nice guy I'd like to see yours too uh, ZZ your cook kit and then Kyle my Oklahoma YouTube friend plant-based survival Let's see what your cook kit is. I know you got some hacks on his too, because what he's done is he's got. What I would like to do with these as well, though, is put some holes in here and put, you know, a handle line where you can hang it over a fire, because he's just sit on there. I'd like to do that to these bigger ones, also. But uh, he's got some cool cook kit stuff, though, and I'd like to see. I'd like to see the whole thing, all of it together, you know. So go. Um, I'll put a link to all their channels down there too so you guys can uh, check them out too but I'd like to thank Jep from Jep's Outdoor Adventures for tagging me in this I much appreciate it man and uh, hope this helps you and uh, go check him out he's got a cool channel like I said he's a young guy and he loves the outdoors you know he wants to be outdoors and not playing video games and stuff like that like a lot of our kids nowadays are so let's give him some encouragement and everything like that but this is me saying keep it heavy, everyone. Talk to you soon.